Good morning my YouTube brothers and sisters. Well, reality to the world is here to take you on a little tour. This tour is to take you around the city. I'm heading to the market to purchase some fruits. And at the set time, I'm going to just try to show you around the city. All right. The first thing we are Durban and Mandela Avenue. Where you see in the traffic light. That's Durban and Mandela Avenue. And to some people who mightn't come home in years, at least you can see a glimpse and just give this video a thumbs up. Reality to the world trying his best to help you remember certain landmarks and certain buildings. So the first building I'm going to explain to you on the left hand side that's the building there that is the National Cultural Center and the National Cultural Center used for different events everybody know about the National Cultural Center on the right hand side you see in that white building I think that building is the Chinese building I think that is the home they purchased the piece of land and they decided to build that huge building that you see in there so we turn on home stretch this is home stretch so as you can see national cultural center you can get a better view and a better glimpse of it so that is the national cultural center these are landmarks that you would never ever forget because as a child many of you are going to school come to the national cultural center so that is the national cultural center so you see there's a hut with a blue zinc that coming up on the left hand side let me show you yes right there so that is the ncn that is where they um the guy in the news they're going to do the editing and on the next and this green building right there that is the sports hall that they keep the indoor tournament like basketball football tennis what's not what's not and if you look way ahead you're going to see some stands on the left hand side that is the um Durban Park where people go and they play cricket and you know um, You can go and sit down and hang out and just relax You can see coffee from at the top right there. You see the vehicle the rotation how the road how everything set Now this is the junction This is the junction straight over is on to John Road. So we're making a left onto Region Street. Right over there, there's a football ground that is the GFC ground where a lot of football competition take place. And the next building is the GCC ground. And going straight is going west. We're making a turn onto Chandapal Avenue. So where you see in that smoke, that is the cemetery road. Those vehicles going through the cemetery road. You see where you see in that child riding that cycle, that is Durban Street. So where you see in there is Durban and Cemetery Road. And where the smoke coming from, that's inside the cemetery. We're making a left onto North Road. This is North Road we're heading to. So I hope you guys following me. We're gonna go over, I think it's called Michael. I can't remember the name of this street, but let's go. There's a lot of huge buildings. So I think this street that coming up here, this is Albert Street. Yes, this is Albert Street. We jump over Albert Street onto North, onto North Road. We're still on North Road. And on the right, where are you seeing that with those little stumps? I think straight along there is Marymount's Mall. Now we're approaching Light Street. So North Road and Light Street, 
this is where we at right there. And I can tell you, many Guyanese, 90% of Guyanese who come home, trust me, they will always go to the market. Why? Because they want all the fresh fruits. They want the banana, the papa, the cashew, the mango, the guava, the cherry, the sour sap. You name it. They must come down and go to the market. Plus, don't forget and not forgetting the coconut water with the jelly. Once you drink the coconut water, you're asking for your jelly. So you're getting a sneak little preview of Guyana, the market from at the top. This is what the market look like. So that is Regent Street and that is Orange Walk run right to Regent Street, straight over. So where we at here we at on avenue of republic and as i can tell you as i say before that guyan have so many vehicles so whenever you have to go out you have to make sure that you leave early so you can get where you go in because if you don't leave early you can get caught up in this traffic so we are now heading over region street and if you look all the way to the left hand side you're going to see that peach building that is the supreme court well guyana was once ruled by the british the british ruled guyana from 1814 to 1966 as you can see that we have the queen right there i have a little history bracket that i'm showing you right there so you can see guyana was colonized by the british So that small building on the left that is the next courthouse so we're going to make a right so right in front of you you are seeing the big market and as I can tell you anytime you come to Guyana whosoever looking at this video and you decide to come to Guyana once you take any bus from anywhere this is your final destination. They must bring you to the big market. The buses on the left hand side, that is the Kitty Camberfield buses parked there. And if you look to the left, there's a building that, that is the Demico building. And the taxis, those guys conduct their daily work there, hustling, looking to earn their daily earnings. As you can see, that's the Demico. So you see, I have one of my friends right there. So, and I can tell you, yo, Guyana is so hot. But you see, at the end of the day, regardless, the sun is so hot. You just have to make sure that you arm yourself with your umbrella whatsoever and come out to hustle because you have to hustle. Because at the end of the day, you have to make sure you take home a daily bread. Even self is a even self. If it's a 10,000, a 12,000, a 7,000, whatsoever. Look at the beautification there. And people who go into the market, once they purchase the items, they purchase the goods, they have their own choice. They can either come and take a taxi or take the minibus to take them wheresoever if they're going home, they, wheresoever they're going. So they have a choice. You see that lady that's selling papers there? She's selling papers there for years. I would like to big her up. Just in case you're looking at this video, enough love and respect to you. Keep the hustle, keep the strength, keep the power. Yes, 
yes look at the city eh? the scenery is from top wonderful wonderful as isn't it sweet awesome eh? yeah man so as i continue my little stroll you see this is some of my rest of brethren here so taxi park all the way around demico so as you can see i stop and give them a little shout out hail them up you know give them high five because you don't forget where you come from you know you must give your brethren them some check holla at them see what so i'm trying to now take a video with each and every one of us because we work out there for years maybe like those guys out there like 15 years some more long than that so you must stop once you come around and give them guys a shout out so yeah we don't know so love and antics representing for guyana you know my love like my girlfriend angela rough and tough guyana is where i'm from located south american region neighbor to brazil and venezuela so run on in the atlantic ocean chan guyana is where i'm from in South American region, neighbor to Brazil and Venezuela, so we're not the Atlantic Ocean. Sure. So many times you need a vacation, make a know your destination. It is clear God bless this nation with beauty and natural mineral. And Lord, we have the longest one dropping on the world, longest floating bridge, boys and girl. Mount Moran, so I eat a glitter like pearl. It is so great. Says Mrs. Man, Guyana is where I'm from. Located South American region, neighbor to Brazil and Venezuela. So we're in the Atlantic Ocean. Chan. Guyana is where I'm from. Located South American region, neighbor to Brazil and Venezuela. So we're in the Atlantic Ocean. Chan. We have ten regions. Hey. Six different races, hey. Indian majority, African second place, mixed free Chinese and European face. All of us are dwelling in one place. Main religion is Christian.